Hello guys, uh, today I'm going to show you how to bypass FRP on the latest Samsung Galaxy S10, S10 Plus, uh, Note 9, Galaxy S9 and every Samsung device which, which is running on Android 9. So let's get started. Okay, skip this step for now. Connect to Wi-Fi, it is important that you stay connected to Wi-Fi all the time. Okay, here we go, checking for updates. Okay. You should click on the use Google account instead. Okay. Okay. Click on email or phone box to open the keyboard and click on the little gear that is above number 9 and 8. Okay. So now you want to click on the back arrow on the left upper corner. Click here and it will take you to the uh, keyboards. Go to the Google voice typing. Okay, over here you will need to search for offline search. Offline search. Okay, here it is. Uh, manage offline searches. No thanks. Okay, so click on the search icon over here. And over here you will need to search for internet. Internet. Or I can see that the internet is not showing up even so you can search for chrome okay here we go you need to click on the chrome icon this is on the bottom okay great accept and continue hit no thanks and we officially are on the google chrome go to the to a search engine for example we'll go to the google.com and over here i will need you to search alb viral android nine frp okay hit search here we go uh, you should open the first one which reads bypass slash remove google account lock frp on android 9 okay here we go okay close and accept this one okay so uh this is a tutorial we don't need to to read this one okay so you need to go to this one download this tool it's the seventh step Click here to download. Okay, here we go. Chrome needs storage to download files. Continue. We allow the, the access. Okay, so we download it with enabled viral tool.apk. Hit OK. It will. Okay, great. So something is downloading and we will most probably see open on the bottom. Once we see open, we should hit open. And if it doesn't show up okay here it is open if it doesn't show up we have a red button over here or it may be three dots we click over here and we go to downloads here we go here we have the application we just downloaded add viral okay so uh, for security reason your phone is not allowed so we go to settings we enable allow from this source we hit back then hit install and open Okay, great. So we have two options, Bypass and the Google Account Manager. Hit on Google Account Manager, APK install for version 5.0. Choose a 5.0 this time. Okay, go to settings, enable allow from this source, hit back, next, next, install. Here we go. Installed, app installed, okay. Now click on the Bypass FRP, go to browser sign in. Here we go, click on the three dots, upper right corner, browser sign in will show up. Okay, one more time, hit OK. And it will take you to the Google login page. So this is what we need. Now we need to sign in with our Gmail account. I will sign in with mine in, in one second. Okay. Okay, great. signing in one moment please okay we're in so our google account is already there so let's let's give it a try on bypass frp go to settings go to accounts and backups uh accounts on top and we can see that our email is over there added already go back back go to biometrics and security Okay, fingerprints, add your fingerprints, continue, set a pin, require pin when the device power is on, 
one 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 continue one 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 okay okay so we already have set up pin also so we have two options we can either unlock the phone via google email or we can unlock the phone via pin lock okay so now just go back 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 all the way back 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 we need to go back to the first page okay and now let's just set up the phone one more time okay skip for now connect it to wi-fi hit next great account edit okay hit next no backups found just a second accept scroll down hit ok adding fin the finish Shin touches touches apps <coughs> oh we can skip this one we don't need a Samsung account hold on your phone your phone is ready to use okay great so now once we are the home page it is important that we go to settings and we make a factory reset in order not to have any application extra application installed so fact Factory, factory data reset okay factory data reset reset phone enter your pin which we have four ones delete all okay okay great so after the phone starts right now it will be completely in unlock states you will be able to get updates regularly and the phone will work just like a new one Thanks for watching, give it a like and subscribe and don't forget to leave a comment below.